today, I'd, I'd like to talk to you about data factory versus logic apps, right? Uh, I get a lot of customers ask, okay, should I use logic apps for this or data factory? And of course, the answer in, in technology and consulting is it depends, right? What is the business use case we're talking about? Um, logic apps can really help you simplify how you build automated, uh, scalable workflows that integrate apps and data uh, across cloud services and on-premises systems, okay? Uh, Azure Data Factory is obviously a cloud-based data integration service that allows you to create data-driven workflows in the cloud for orchestrating and automating data movement and data transformation. Pretty similar definitions, right? Uh, and, and I get it, it can be kind of confusing. Uh, we have situations where, um, you know, the best case scenario is to actually use both of them, right? So uh, where maybe a feature is lacking in Data Factory and Logic Apps has because it's been around for a little bit longer. Uh, you know, for instance, uh, alerting and notifications. Uh, you, can usually, you can easily use the, the web API um, out of Data Factory and send a notification through a Logic App uh, via email back to a user saying the job failed or the job completed with uh, XYZ parameters, right? Great use case of how you would use them together. Um, I guess if, if I had to step back and ask, why would I use one over the other? It's probably gonna come down to how much data we're moving and how much transformation we really need uh, to do on that data to make it ready for consumption, you know, through reporting or however we're going to use it, right? Are we going to put it in Azure Data Warehouse, um, you know, and, and build some facts and dimensions and, and create uh, our enterprise data warehouse and then report off of it with Power BI, uh, you know, which would require a, a usually a, typically a fair amount of data movement and transformation. Um, you know, and, and you know, a, a decent amount of heavy lifting. I probably wouldn't have you use a Logic App for that. But if, um, if you're monitoring a folder on-prem or, or uh, in OneDrive and uh, you're looking to see when files get posted there um, because a user is sharing them to a folder when they're done with it or something like that, uh, and you want to simply move that file to another location or send a notification saying, hey, this file has been received uh, or, you know, this file has been updated or, or whatever that action is, um, you know, that could be a great use case for a logic app. Uh, you know, uh, as I said, the, the real sweet spot is when you can use them together uh, because I think it helps you maximize cost. Uh, so, you know, depending on what the operation is, uh, it can be more expensive or less expensive depending on whether you're using Data Factory and Logic Apps, and using the Azure Pricing Calculator can help you with that. Um, you know, but the, the nice thing is there is you can make your operations really efficient. You can um, y use the power of Azure Data Factory with its SSIS integration runtimes, uh, you know, and, and, you know, feature sets that include things like Databricks and, um, you know, the HD Insight clusters, uh, where you can process, you know, massive amounts of data uh, with massively parallel processing or, uh, you know, use your uh, Hadoop file stores, right, for, for um, reporting off of structured, unstructured, and semi-structured data. A lot of options there on how you can use it. Um, but really, Logic Apps can help you enhance that, that process, if you will, right? Uh, so... I know, clear as mud, uh, but hopefully that kind of breaks it down a little better. So if you think about logic apps, think about business applications. If you think about data factory, think about moving data, large data sets, transforming, uh, transforming data, uh, you know, building data warehouses, uh, those types of things. So uh, hopefully that helps clear things up a little bit. Uh, if you have more questions, feel free to uh, reach out, click the link below, and, and we'd be happy to help out. Uh, we love playing with Azure and, and all that Microsoft has to offer for their cloud platform, and I and, uh, hope you do too. Have a great day. Thanks.